Okay, team, we need to keep cranking out these Christmas movies. I mean, I think we've done it all. Right? Guys, we are sitting on a gold mine. Every time we make a movie, no matter how crappy it is, people actually watch it. They are very soothing. Like Christmas Prozac. Now, we have one more primetime spot to fill this week, which gives us like five minutes to write this. That sounds about average. So dig deep, guys. Come on, what do you got? Okay, Big City Lawyer goes back home. Already did it. Big City Banker goes back home. Already did it. Big city NASA engineer. Already did, actually, we've never done that. Oh, women in STEM too, we need that. Okay, now, she doesn't believe in Santa. Yes. Because hard science has hardened her cold heart. Amazing. And she's on a space telescope and she's like, hey, there's totally a man flying in orbit up there. Could that be Santa Claus? How is he in space without a spacesuit? Doesn't matter, keep going. So she's like, I need real proof. I'm gonna steal a rocket ship to find out if he's really Santa. Ooh, nope, nope, gotta scrap this. Yep. Why? Guys, come on. What's the number one rule for making these movies? It's, it's a, a safe, safe bet to, to reuse, reuse our sets. sets. Of course, now what else you got? Ooh, Santa's son is looking for love. Bingo. Santa is like, you need to find a girl who's gonna be Mrs. Claus someday. I love it. But Santa takes away his trust fund to make sure she loves him for all the right reasons. So Santa has a son sure. with a trust fund? Doesn't matter. And there's a girl. She needs a ridiculous Christmas name. Joy Von Mistletoe. Used it. Noel LeBlanc. Used it. Candy, holly jolly. That works, gotta keep moving. How did they meet? At a museum. Not too expensive. At a bookstore? No one reads books. Ooh, her dog Dasher runs away and he helps her find it. Bullseye. Because he can talk to animals. Santa can talk to animals, right? Mm, is it possible for Santa's son to take his shirt off? Sure, they can visit a children's hospital. Why would anyone take their shirt off in a children's hospital? We did it in a cure for a Christmas prince. Yeah, they sure did. Okay, moving on. And she's like, Am I really falling in love with this man who doesn't have a car and talks to animals? Also, could he be Santa Claus? Wait, so why does she think he's Santa? Ooh, because he's rapidly gaining weight and growing a white beard. No, that's that Tim Allen does Doesn't matter. matter. So they go together to the town skating rink. We could just use the video of the rink from our last movie. And Santa Jr. is like, Candy, I've really grown to love you. Oh wait, my accent's really off. Candy, I've really grown to love you in the last seven minutes. Will you marry me and come live with me? Is that a southern accent? Sure. I thought he lived in the North Pole. No, remember, he lives in space. No, he doesn't. We nixed the space idea at the very beginning. Shoot it on the green screen. Done. Okay, now what's the ending? And he's like, now you can travel the galaxy in my sleigh. And by the way, I'm really Santa's hot son. Wait, he's hot again? You said like 30 seconds ago that he was rapidly gaining nope. weight. After they kiss, he turns back into a prince. Wait, is he a prince or is he Santa? Whatever, and she's like, oh yay! Boom, credits. I don't like it. I love it! All right, knew you would. Okay, last thing, what do we name it? Falling in love with Santa. Too predictable. Out of this world Christmas. Closer. A Christmas love out of this world for Christmas. That's the one. Okay, that's it. We start shooting in three minutes. How is that possible? We don't even have a cast. No, it's okay. I just got the girl from Avengers. Oh, Scarlett Johansson? No, Maria Wilson. And she was... Uncredited New York jogger. Perfect. I know I say this every time, but guys, this one is special. <laughs>